Hello everybody, Typhoon Lordgrief here with uh, my dear tree friend, the Cypress. How y'all doing today? Yeah, I'm not good at this. Uh, so we just defeated the Titanate. That's the thing that happened. Yeah, yeah, we just beat the freaking Titanate. And gave that you a golden banana. A fight. Yep, gave me a golden banana. Now I can I did not believe out. you could do it. I know, you have like no faith in me. I will continue to have no faith in you. All right, let's uh, let's just, just some treasures. Golden banana gives plus fifteen gold from treasure hunts. That's that's actually really good. Also, all crew members within rage gain a plus two to speech. Right. That's right. incredibly powerful for Status. your magician. I'm gonna go here. All right, we're gonna be last. Leave off. What do you want to do? Uh, yeah, you know. Uh, we had just beat Titan Ape, and that was a whole ordeal. I died like yes. three times. Um, <laughs> but right now we are in uh, the Caribbean. We are going to this to find this lost pirate treasure. Uh, Skull Waterfall Island. Skull Waterfall Island. Uh, so I'm going to go down here because resources can be gained. It looked interesting. What an amazing find. In the deep jungle, you find the elusive hundred-year fruit. The low-hanging fruit takes more than a hundred years to grow to size. Surrounding the fruit is a barrel of monkeys performing a ritual never witnessed. You can take the fruit to safety, and naturals might be interested in the, in the mon monkey rituals. I think, in the West, this is called a pineapple. <laughs> I, th I, think, I think in the West, this is called, why the heck did it take a hundred years to grow? I don't want that crap. It takes too long. Okay, let's uh, let's let's just study them. We have a hundred percent chance. So, Anne observes that the monkeys know about the fruit, studying cultural memory in this barrel. Once the monkeys start checking the tr tree, making squish noises and explosive gestures, Anna starts to get anxious and rushes and takes the fruit. The monkeys are seemingly disappointed. With the research of fruit in hand, you have heartbreak broken monkeys behind. Awesome broke monkeys hearts. Screw this little sapient. Right on. A rare fruit that takes over a hundred years. You gain no actual effects from this. Ah, but oh, at least you own it now. Ooh, Small dude, it's a... supplies. No. You can't. You can't risk it. No, I can't. Ooh. Caribbean dagger. Caribbean glyph. Zimmy's talisman. Okay. Uh, what do you think? I want to buy one of them. Uh, a choice between either the glyph or the talisman. Oh, if only I had a coin nearby. I do. Flip it. Uh, heads, glyphs, tails, talisman. Alright, here we go. Uh, head. Head? Yep. So glyph. Alright, sweet. Oh, look at plus it. five no, speech power plus five grip. Oh, that's pretty nice. That's not bad. Wait, you can buy the talisman too? I oh. have the money for it, but I have like only 100 gold. Yeah. Yeah, I'll buy the talisman. It Why seems not? cheaper than uh, other of. Oh, that cheaper. was worth it. That was definitely worth it. I can give that to uh, to the little girl, to the magician, whatever her name is. I can't remember it anymore. Oh, ooh, there's a treasure option up to the north. Yeah, I know, that's what I was going to hit. Alright. Be mindful of your supplies, though. You can do it. It's a defensive item. You might have to take off the ring first. Oh, does it not automatically replace? You have to take it off first? Obviously. Apparently. Hildegard. Hildegard, that is trinket. such a magician name. Oh, that's nice. It fits right onto here, too. She doesn't cool. take anything off for it. Oh, yeah, because that's a trinket, not a defensive item. Yep. And now she will have still... Ah, she has the most spirit now. She's a tank. Doesn't matter. Mr. Afro's just going to die anyway. Right. 
everything's gonna target and kill him. You find a huge tree that towers above the canopy in the deep jungle. One crew member can go climb the tree, so it's up there. Many things can be found in the jungle canopies, but you can expect physical challenges, biological data, or hidden bounties. It's up to you. It's gotta be Anna. She's the best at this kind of stuff. She's not really the athletic, but she's probably your best botanist. Uh, we'll, we'll take a look at the can canopy's ecology. A rare tree orchid. Long Tear. thought to be extinct. Tear orchid, you're right. <laughs> tree orchid. It's a tree flower. That's redundant. <laughs> Another treasure, good job. Studies the jungle canopy. She yeah. had so much studies. <laughs> looks like you have just looks like you have just enough supplies to make it to your destination. If if you if you need to do it, let Lex supply go do it. She 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 walked to the door like she wanted to use the bathroom, but it looked like she didn't want to make noise. Your cat? Uh, my woman. She can go pee if she needs to go pee. This is something you shouldn't have to tell her to do. I know. Oh, wow. I'm going to get yeah. some supplies. Oh, you got 100 lucky. 100 chance. Well, Earl, you're actually making use of yourself now. Good on you. The only thing he's useful for? Scavenging. Scavenging. Let's head down again. Find nothing of note. Oh, no. No, nothing of note. Right here. Entourage shit. Beautiful clean creek. Well, Hildegard has to surprise everybody. If, if, if Anna does it, they'll all die of a heart attack. Probably, she's terrifying. Internationally acclaimed science prize that Hildegard earned a few months ago. Really? This little girl That's is just awesome. amazing! Delightful dinner is served by Hildegard. Anna. No, man, you should have went with Anna. That would have been awesome. All right. I'm that was a up. pleasant little uh, segue. <laughs> mm -hmm. The hidden treasure by the Notorious Captain Rogue. All right. I believe that's pronounced Rogue or Rock. I just wanted to say Rogue. Because this is in the Caribbean, and CH is a hard K. The guidance of Anna ellipses. <laughs> that, that's being very facetious. She's been decent at guiding y'all. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't even bother. Screw yeah. this. Thing. Uh, she'll, he'll, he'll study. Smuggler's boss. I heard these rats were on my island. I didn't think they'd be so kind as to find a treasure for me. Get your paws off my booty, land lovers. Uh, you have the object for you. What a jerk. Watch out! It's a holy shit, it's a sea mine! Earl. Earl, Earl's useful again. <laughs> well, you know, his. Look at all those bonuses. He has way over 100%. Oh, 100 yeah. 100% from engineer. Just an engineer alone. Yeah. You know, his explosive is his specialty. That and getting his ass kicked. With sweaty hands, Earl manages to defuse the old bomb. Oh, this is awesome. The boss confronts you. It seems you won't go down with this old sea mine. I'll show you what happens when you disrespect my territory. Fellas, get the treasure and crush these land lovers. It seems okay. there's no choice. It's another class 3 fight. Oh my god. Yeah, this one's going to be a lot easier, though. I, well, yeah. I state this on no is so much tankier. Let's see what's going to happen here. Scroll over it. Smuggler is convinced of your cause. Boss confidence broken. Rid the island of the boss. 
Oh, what? You want to befriend him? I'm gonna end this in another friendly manner? It's, it's going against your creed, man. You, you, you ain't good. You ain't lawful. You're, you're, uh... What is it, neutral? I don't know my DND terminology. Alright, so how are you gonna proceed in this encounter? Uh, about the same as I usually do. So terribly. <laughs> I still love how one guy gets intimidated or flattered and the other guy gets shot in the goddamn face. <laughs> Don't you love the way that works? I love it. That's why Earl always dies. Because he's a dick. No one likes you, Earl. Aw. Then she is incredibly tanky. Earl has like 10 less health than anybody else now. Well, at least he's proven himself to be, at least moderately, a bit of a, a modicum of usefulness in this particular endeavor. Right, he's pretty good for out of combat stuff. Well, when it comes to in combat, you'd assume he'd be the best, you know, the guy that's armed with armor and actually armed. But no, the, the magician, she's the, the your most <laughs> powerful combatant. Get her out of the field. I'm with that one guy you just shot in the face. He's like, what is? What is? She gets a juggling act. I get the pellets to the face. This is unfair. I get the pellets to the face. This is sexist. Oh, that was the best though. Oh, you're impressive. That's what you're doing. Yeah. I, I just take her out of combat. Him out of combat. He's got a gun. I could take either one out instantly. Oh, he's already injured. I mean, a hard wind could knock him down. Right. I'm gonna end up scaring him out of combat. Oh right? my god, Earl. Earl. Yeah. Earl just he's dies just every freaking game. This is why I don't spend resolve. Because Earl's just gonna die. Oh, they're infinitely spawning. Yeah, they're all, always infinitely spawning. I, I, I hate that. I don't like infinitely spawning enemies. It's I feel too... like this is a game cheating. Eh, it's to encourage you to... Um... Really take down the boss and not just completely uh, cheese the uh, what is it called? The mood wheel. No, wait, no. It's it's not always infinitely respawning. It's only for, like, uh, boss encounters, is it? Like that. But still, that's... Damn. Oh, you got lucky, man. That was the luck of the ages. So, though, I think this is a loss. No, I'm actually pretty confident in this one. Well, I was until I saw the guy's health. I'll have to rethink how I'm going to do this. I might have to, I might have to get an aggressive victory. It's, if Earl it's, does anything right, it's just it's just sheer levels of aggression. Look at that health bar, man. Yeah. He has as much health as the gorilla did. Well, this is a, a tier 3 encounter. Yep. So I'll probably lose. I just hit so hard. Yeah. And game over. Alright, let's retry it. I knew you couldn't do it. I know, I, I die like every time. Like every time. <laughs> Until either through luck or this or rap or revolving strategy, I defeat them. <laughs> So 
you're gonna try to call the herd and focus on the ball. Pretty much. Why well, are you getting luckier with these numbers, with these rolls this time around? Well, yeah, I got lucky that he got a crit. The strategy doesn't didn't change from it, but he, I was pretty lucky he got that crit. Damn it, Earl! Oh yeah, they do. Yeah, they do like Boku damage. Nah, dude. Shoot her in the face. Nah, he can't reach. He can hit her with this, though. <laughs> she is intimidating. Yeah, tell me about it. Oh, you got 20, plus 25 grit. That's nice. You almost got true grit. <laughs> You should have healed Earl. Earl's far enough away. Ah, oh, with her tanking, this is, uh... Yeah! Yeah, this, this may actually be it. No more pirates aside to, uh... God damn it. I don't care if they come from that direction. Because it's really just Earl who's my, uh... My linchpin. Your weakest link. Proking the bear mind games. <laughs> He's like, I'm waiting. I just tried to slice your throat out. <laughs> nice, a nerve. Nice. It's just horrible. Only he could, uh... Buff one? Buff one of your what? other characters? Right, but he doesn't have any buffs. That's the thing. He doesn't have the range for it either. What, he can't be like, You see my boomstick? Does this impress you? No? Damn. Well, damn. Yeah, I saw that coming. Well, that's what Earl can be used for. You can use him to like help defend your flanks. Pretty much. Where the real ladies actually get the real work done. And he does hit hard, though. Oh, yeah. I just buffed him, too. Well, actually, technically I debuffed him. Mine's 25 speech defense. You gotta scroll over those little icons there, man. Actually, think, figure out what's on your character. Uh, right now, it's uh, plus twenty. No, right there, speed. at the top, right there. Yeah. Oh, these. Mm -hmm. These are the, re the results. Still though. Of the uh, when I set it to the top. Mm -hmm. Mine 25 speech defense. That's a speech attack. That's that too is a speech attack, yeah. That that's speech. I was thinking which one was doing more damage. The, the, that's yeah. what mind games is. Yeah. Alternating. <laughs> I like your hair! I'm gonna kill your dog! What? I don't understand. What do you mean you're gonna kill my dog? Wait, what do you mean? What do you mean I'm gonna kill your dog? That's pretty self-explanatory, Bob. This is tight. Alright, you can't do anything this turn. Oh, who cares? If only she could do it to herself. You can't cheer up yourself, man. That's not how life works. That's why you pay professionals to do it for you. There we go, he has his speech defense back. Nice. Keep laying the damage down on that boss. Now, this is going a lot better than before. I th I'm thinking. Somewhat. There's still no thoughts going through my head. 
His attack is now minus 25%. Good. If he hits you, it's gonna it's gonna be a lot helpful. Oh, yep, there it went. But still, that was nowhere near how much. Oh yeah. Before. Oh, you got enemies flanking on the rear. Uh huh. That's why I sent Earl down. He just couldn't reach. No, I mean new ones there. Yeah. Yeah. This is gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt them too. To the face. Yule to the fuck. Devious abilities increased. Awesome. Hey, you, get another minus 25 speech. Mm. We're playing horrible mind games with this man. I know, I love this game. You're killing his crew and just <laughs> fucking with him. He's so confused. <laughs> love it. Oh, I reset his mood. <laughs> That's fine. Probably gonna hurt you, though. Is he gonna run? No, he's buffing himself. He's raging himself up. Oh. Don't do it, Earl. Don't you do it, Earl. I'd like to have a fight where Earl doesn't die and we win. That's probably what's going to happen here. Just uh, focus on the big guy. That's not good. Has to be her first. Crap. Why'd you do that? Because I hit the wrong click. Oh, Earl's dead. Probably. Oh, she's buffed. But I doubt it's gonna take him out, yeah. You could have ended it this turn, too. Yep. But there's no backseas when I misclick, so. <laughs> do it! Whoa! Yeah, you could have won, but uh, nope. Could have. Oh, nope. One misclick. This is complete game. One misclick cost you an entire fight. One misclick. Oh yeah. Oh fuck this. Ah, uh, <laughs> I, I love that. That wasn't the game's fault. That was your fault. Oh. Ah, that's that's the defeats I love the most. The ones that no, no, that was fair. You were winning. You could have won, but you didn't. I'm really rubbing that in. I'm He's sorry. Oh, uh, it's fine. I wasn't paying attention anymore. Oh, <laughs> uh, you have AoE? Yeah, there you go. Wow. Nah, I think her AoE is more of a meant to buff your your team. <laughs> no. No, nah, because it has no. Yeah, you're right. It's, a, it's, a, it's an aggressive attack. Yeah, she just doesn't have a super high, uh, attack. His is significantly higher. I still can't believe that it didn't work. Well, it's not like they're monkeys. Why did you make it look like you weren't gonna attack Earl, then attacked him? Did you see because that? Because he wanted to position himself. And if you attack, you lose your movement turn. Right. The AI knows how to screw you. Forfeit a counter. Will that, will that no, go to the, no. uh, yeah, yeah, resolve yeah, broken yeah. screen? It yeah. will? Safe right. watch. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. This is the fourth. This is the fourth. I've lost three times, uh, so I usually win the fourth time. Well, you <laughs> could have won earlier. You're paying attention. I misclicked. <laughs> I just found out I could click out of the menus like a few moments ago. Uh, I had no idea. All right. Let's see. She can't do significant damage with that. She can't do significant damage with that. So go over to her, buff her. Okay, she won't knock anybody out this turn. What a shame. 
Earl's the only person right now who can actually one hit somebody. Because he's got that massive buff on his attack. Gotta oh, like, get yeah. what, five turns of extra uh, aggressive damage? Look at that. He actually out damages the enemies right now. Because he's got that temporary uh, campaign buff. Ow. Well, thank goodness the enemies aren't hitting you for 40 to 30 damage. Right. Right. I would be dead. Instantly. You know what he got insanely lucky on that previous encounter? The boss just not being able to hit you. Oh, yeah, that was awesome. I mean, he one shot at you in the end there. You got lucky with those misses. I don't know if it's my computer, but for some reason my headset keeps like put in like hiccups in the audio. I hope it doesn't appear in the uh I don't think it'll appear in the final product because it's cause my headset is like taking a bunch of screams. But it is disconcerting. Not sure man. I'm captivated by this encounter. This is just as difficult as that ape was. If not more, because this guy when he but when he's buffed up, he has the potential of just one shotting one of your characters, right? And just straight up, just cleaving their head off. And that's why you got the 15, 14 year old girl man in the front line. All right, that lowers his speech defense. Good. Now shoot him in the face. Actually, yeah, it would be much wiser to get the uh, companion out of there. There's one thing... Their companions are using a There's one attacks. thing Darkest Dungeon has taught me. Even if the, the other mob in the arena is weaker, getting them out of the arena takes priority. Because that's just extra damage you're just preventing from happening. Right. It's called the foil method of, uh, mm -hmm. of gaming. You destroy the weakest first. If there's one thing Warhammer 40k has told me, even a lucky roll in a Grotchling can take out your Space Marine Land Raider. I've seen it happen! <laughs> Alright, this is going pretty good. I just hope he doesn't hit anybody. Right. I, just, I want him to target Anna. Uh. Oh, he neutralized. That's fine, though. That's fine. You can easily put him back into his pre previous mood. Second. No misclicks. The board is clear. No. No. To the left. Yeah. I could have swore they weren't there before, though. Oh, well. Yeah, so could I. They, like, came out of nowhere. They came. Blackness. Um. Yeah, this will do. It's just a shame that your best healer is also the one that's injured. Right. Let's For what little it's worth. You never know when six hit points have just come in handy. Oh. God, that, that freaking horizontal gut wrencher. Oh well. Use Earl to get her up. Then the fight's yep. over. If it hit. Alright. Hit or you're good. Oh, hit.
Uh, I'm, I'm not gonna risk anything on 80% chance. <laughs> you did it! And it went over to Devious. Nice. His confidence is broken. I, I was gonna try to. You're gonna try to befriend him, but no. Yeah. It's so hard to befriend people. Oh, well, you, you're. He totally broke their spirits. Smuggler boss is having difficulty keeping his act together and runs oh away my in tears. Shit. His crew follows to at least try to cheer him up. You hear their voices fade into distance. Come on, boss, you ain't that bad. We love you. You're the baddest smuggler on this island. <laughs> the smuggler's gone. It's safe to retrieve. Rock's treasure. You 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 broke his spirits. Right. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's nice. Not bad. Not bad at all. Looks magnificent. The scent of gold fills the air. The rock's treasure in your hands. The expedition. Blah blah blah. Blah, blah, blah. Aggressive. Treasures. Four treasures. Yeah, you did really well in the treasure front on this one. I assume. I'm not that well versed in this game. Right. So many research tokens. So many Oh, your, your... The main uh, composition here, that word again, of your squad is research. You're already the, mo the seventh right. most renowned explorer in the world. Right on. All that right. You should read this. It's very important. This decision uh, it will last the entire game. Send a report to an explorer. Welcome to the city. This is unlocking new possibilities in the world map. You can only unlock one city, one city per expedition. Later expeditions may add new options. Uh, so should I send it to Istanbul or should I send Istanbul? It to Constantinople. But it was Istanbul. It was not it was Constantinople. Istanbul. I hate you so much. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you All clever right. dick. Uh, okay. I'm gonna go with the equipment ah, shop. That's what I want to. Mainly because, well, for obvious reasons. Even though cons I don't have. Uh, uh, you don't. You, you don't have the. Uh, what? The green. The green token for an the... draw. You know, your your group is not friendly enough to really uh, be able to get the benefit from that. Right. Greetings. Uh, it would be nice, but it just it just ain't ain't it. Woo! You didn't know about that, did oh, you? That's awesome. Yeah, Anna's brilliance. Oh. This is for you, Earl. Yeah, Earl. These are both for you. Cause you're a dick. <laughs> Come on, Earl. Why not to be, be fair, he actually did not fall in that last uh, combat encounter. Anna was the one that fell. True. True. She was the one who took the God, blow. was that a blow, too? Oof, right across the mid section. God, 39 damage. She, she could only have taken that from, like, almost full health. That was impressive. You may want to invest in better defense items. Or, uh... Right. I should have bought more of the talisman stuff because that was actually pretty good. Yeah, but so the uh, those items from that village were not only cheaper but just gave better benefits. Look at this. Right. I don't know. Well, you you can you, yeah, you can upgrade. You, know, you need to upgrade your uh, offensive items. You're still using the starter ones. Look at that. Ugh, awful across the board. Here. I upgraded the shop. You don't have enough gold to invest into upgraded stuff for the shop. Yeah, but now I can look at some of the better stuff, see if I want to do anything. Yeah, I know. You know? Book of Joy only has pictures. <laughs> okay. So she is still probably going to be my, uh, Sadden, try to sadden. Impress, try to impress. This will be good for her. Um, <laughs> by 20%. Yeah, that's pretty good. Not bad. Because she, she doesn't... She, she does. She so is a bedazzler. Book of Horrors. Will Anna. For, uh, my leader She's of the very, in very intimidating. Oh. 
You just open it up and like tentacles fly out. Please, never make that noise again. <laughs> uh, what, my I just got done playing Darkest Dungeon, man. Just ugh. <laughs> You'll get a book of that ass link too. Yeah, but he, he never uses it. I have him use it occasionally. Mostly for healing. Which, which is garbage for him. Still improve its effect. Not slightly less garbage. Hey, six health helps at any given right. time. What else are you gonna do? You can spend some of those renown points. You mean no, Oh, yeah, inside? inside and some of that green stuff. Whatever it's called. There's gold, something, entourage. entourage. That it. The entourage no, I used for the. Uh... Yeah. Just spend some of that status. Get get some more entourage. The earlier you invest into it, the more benefit you get in the long run. There we go. I'll, oh, I'll get she, a more she got a specialist, so man. Uh, I had had enough. I did actually. I had enough. Stop Wait, no, no, no. It wouldn't have mattered really anyway. Every single them. one of those only boost, uh, get boost for friendly encounters. <laughs> Whoa, they're getting so much, so much research from every one of these now. You're so passionate about being terrified. <laughs> She's an amazing teacher, even if I peed myself. <laughs> it was a good kind of peeing myself, okay? What? Nothing. Uh, Nothing at all. I'm just gonna tactically, tactically ignore that. Yeah, you're already six. That's not that bad. That's impressive. Alright, let's just get going. I've already been no. to Highlands, so haven't I? Mm -hmm. Oh, I was to Irish Isles, right? Uh, I guess I'll go to the Highlands if it has what I want. It's a, uh... Oh, it's about friendly encounters. That, that's your weakest oh, link. The trifecta. Yeah. You can Stats. do that one. I see it, uh, used by Secret Alchemy Lab, and two of your... You know, party members are very into that kind of stuff. Tactician, archaeologist, quick thinker, uh, challenges though. You just don't have a well-rounded group, man. I don't. I didn't mean. I was. No, no, to that's fine. It's fine. It's like just that. archaeologist, athlete, this one's my best rogue, one. and survivalist. It's it's got to be this. Molly one mystery. Molly one. mystery one's very easy if you have a good composition of. There's a word again. A friendly. Friendly Explorer. I've been using that word a lot recently. I don't know why. Go I for it. I think I could do this one. Famous last words. I think I can do this. Right. I, I do want to go with the less hard area. I will go for the Hungarian <laughs> Fork. I, I really do think that you. would pitch them up. Yeah, let, let's let's go with it. it looks I'm say, it, it feels like it would be Anna's like signature adventure. Oh, yeah. And, uh... Alright, everybody. Next time, the Hungarian... Alright, we ended it here. Good game. <laughs>